Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft has finally started to test hiding the sidebar and auto hiding the sidebar in Edge Canary, which is a preview version of the browser. Now, if we head up to the ellipsis menu, the three dotted menu, we can see that right next to that, we have a new discover button. And um, if we hover over that discover button now, it actually now shows the sidebar where uh, before this uh, update, that was not the case. And when you hover over the discover button, it shows the uh, discover uh, in the actual site panel. And if you click on the actual new tab page, uh, it will actually auto hide that sidebar. And if we hover over, you can see now everything takes on its original self. And if you want to permanently always show sidebar, you can just click on that little toggle. And there you go. We now have uh, the sidebar displayed again like it used to be prior to this update. Now, when it comes to the actual um, customization of the sidebar, over and above that Discover button that lets you now hover and open the sidebar, there's uh, no new changes or features that I can, can see uh, prior to this update. So, um, just letting you know now that um, you can now auto hide the sidebar and there you go, auto hide sidebar and it's gone. And if you want to open it again, just hover over the Discover button and um, you can also see there is a a couple of glitches and um, this is edge canary so we have a bit of overlay problems with some of those icons but nonetheless it is still early days and this just started rolling out in an overnight update uh, in my region now if we just head to the actual settings quickly for the sidebar and um, yeah you can also toggle on always show sidebar deep in the settings to customize the sidebar which i have posted in a previous video so and if you want to hide it again you can also click on and, unt and untoggle always show sidebar and there we go so uh, auto hide sidebar now available uh, in edge canary version 111 and at this stage not available yet uh, in the stable version and it's still early days as mentioned and there seems to be a couple of bugs with a bit of overlay problems with those different icons and um, but nonetheless a good indication though that uh, microsoft has now started to work on this feature which is actually a highly requested feature when it comes to the sidebar auto hide sidebar and I actually think, as I always say, that's a nice move in the right direction. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.